Yo, 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 what is up, people? Episode 2, man, episode fucking 2. Get a round of applause and Jerry Talks. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Um, as we speak, we got... We got, we got good fucking views on my last Jerry Talks. Holy fucking shit. 375, that's fucking killer. But, uh, yeah, man. Um... I got fucking, yeah, like, as, as you can see by the fucking title of the, the video, I got fucking suspended on Twitter for, for a, uh, for a tweet I made that I was supposed to win, but, uh, yeah, let me, let me go ahead and write, talk, talk about it, um, I just got unsuspended, so, like, I'm, I'm free, I could, I could tweet now, but what happened was, uh, I I think it was like like a week ago or so. Mr. Beast, yes, Mr. Beast made a tweet saying, "Oh, if you if you which call it if if your tweet gets the most like on my tweet, I will give you my Twitter ad revenue revenue whatever the fuck for the next month." And I made the best fucking tweet ever. And I feel like that's the reason why I got banned, suspended on Twitter for seven days. So what I said, what what I said, what, it was, it was the most fucking genius fucking tweet ever. And in no way this was offensive, um, harmful, threatening. It didn't. I didn't see it as breaking the terms of service of Twitter. So. What I said was, Mr. Beast, you should go ahead and, well, fuck um, Adam22's wife for your next video. Now, I just, I'm just going to let that sink in. So, about like an hour or like an hour or so after I made that tweet, I, I, get, I get a notification saying, hey, you violated the terms of service. Uh, we're going to have to suspend your account for the next seven days. And I was just like, what the fuck, man? What what the actual fuck? That's that's crazy. That's crazy. I, I should have won. I should have... I should have fucking won the fucking challenge, whatever. Uh, I think Andrew Tate... Uh, Andrew Tate won the uh, the tweet, so... You know that that makes me less mad, but but still, it it was it was a good it it was a good fucking tweet in my eyes. Like it it was it was spot on. You know, it, it was the time where Adam Twenty Two was getting you know shit on for being a cuck, and I was, it was just out of thin air, and I just got suspended just like that, just like fucking that. So that actually kind of bummed me out throughout the week, but I got it back. So hopefully. We get another challenge. But uh what what else? What else do I want to fucking talk about? Uh the YNW case. Uh, YNW Melly case. Um As far as far as I could tell, uh today uh they had a uh mistrial, so we're gonna have to like wait and see. But in my honest opinion I think he did it. I think he did it because the 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 trajectory of the bullets it, it it looks it looks sus as shit. It just looks fucking sus. Um, I could pull up the evidence, the like the photos, whatever, like the the crime scene, but I I don't know if I'm good if this video will get like deleted or some shit, so I'm not risking that shit. But uh, yeah, I th I think the dude did it. Not only that, uh, that that one text where he was like trying to shush somebody along with like an emoji or some shit. It, it just right, literally right after the, the fucking tragedy, like he made that suspicious text. So yeah, I, I think the dude did it. I'm sorry, but if if you're a fan of YNW Melly, I'm sorry, bro. But he he flat out did it. And if he did didn't do it, then you know, uh, yeah. He, I guess he's an innocent man, but for now, 
I think he did it. I, I think he fucking did it. All right. On, on, on to the next, bro. We're just, we're just fucking balling, bro. We're just fucking balling with fucking, fucking thoughts in my head. Fucking thoughts. Jerry thoughts. Jerry thoughts. Jerry talks, actually. <laughs> Bumba Clyde. Um, fucking, what else? What, 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 I got, I got, I got, I got, I got to think, got to think, got to think. What, what, what else happened? What else happened? Oh, fucking, fucking, uh, um, my thoughts. Oh, the fucking Barbie movie. The fucking Barbie movie. Um. I haven't seen it myself. I I I don't want to see it, but from what I can see from the uh, reviews and shit, it looks terrible. Uh, I, it has it has terrible reviews right now. Uh, apparently, Ken is like super woke, and they have Nicki Minaj music in the background. So that that's already. As soon as I've heard, like, Nikki, I think Ice Spice is in the movie. Like, not in the movie, but, like, her songs and shit. As soon as I've heard that, that it, it, I knew it was just going to be a total blunder. Especially, like, with the added woke chick. It, like, that's just, a, that's just a blunder, bro. It's it's sad. It, it's really sad because now I'm pretty sure they're going to make, like, a Hot Wheels live-action movie. And they're most likely going to fuck that up, too. And I grew up with Hot Wheels. I I grew up with Hot Wheels. I actually have a Hot Wheel car right now. It's a it's an eighty six. I love it. But yeah, like I don't know how they're gonna like. There's no way you can fuck up a Hot Wheels movie, bro. There's just literally no fucking way. Like Barbie movie, sure, sure. Like I don't, I I could give less of a fuck about Barbies, but Hot Wheels, man, you you can't you can't fuck it up. Hollywood, you you just can't fuck it up. Cause we're just talking about cars, like funny looking cars and and loop de loops. That's it. Just 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 fucking cars, cool cool drivers like Vin Diesel, and a bunch of stunts and and loop de loops like, just just nothing but nonstop action. Like that's what I expect in a Hot Wheels live action movie. But we're just going to have to wait and see. And if Hollywood manages to fuck it up, well, fuck, man. That's just terrible. That's that's terrible. That that's that's terrible, man. Like it, it's really fucking terrible. It's just really fucking terrible. Like I'm looking at. So far, it just it just looks bad. The new Barbie movie just looks fucking bad. But like I said, hopefully, hopefully they they don't fuck up Hot Wheels, because if they do, if, if they legit man, I was I'm just gonna be so bummed out. I wanted to watch the new Indiana Jones movie, but I've heard that one was kind of mid as well. But I'm most likely just gonna pirate it, just watch it, because now like nowadays, bro, nowadays with movies, I feel like it's I feel like it's just the right time to just start pirating these types of movies because I, I i don't it's not it's it's not worth it anymore like when it comes to like certain franchises like sure but like dude it's just it's just not worth going to, like not going to it's yeah it's just not fucking worth it it's just not fucking worth it the popcorn popcorn nowadays is just so fucking expensive as shit tickets as well and, and seating not only that, fucking, like, it's just so, it's just so many, like, bad things about the movies now. It's just, it's just bad. Like, if, if you're gonna watch a certain movie, like, like, a fucking Indiana Jones, like, cause I, I was actually, like, willing to watch it, like, in theaters, cause, like, it's Indiana Jones, like, come on now. But, didn't get to see it, so gonna have to pirate it but yeah like i'm not i'm not condoning pirating i'm not i'm not influencing to pirate but at this point at this 
day and age it's just it's just like it's it's really worth it's 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 just worth going on a website and the thing is too like pirated movies now is just have like hd quality so i don't think you will have a problem with quality and like the depending on what website you go to. I'm I'm not going to recommend any websites. Go do that shit yourself. I'm not I'm not here to uh fucking guide you on pirating. But yeah. Yeah. Movies suck nowadays and I I feel like Hollywood is is just having a a very very bad agenda cuz I'm pretty sure we we've seen like three what was it fucking elemental that 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 one movie where like is it's in like those fucking creatures in your head like madness sad guilt whatever fuck feelings it, it, I don't know it's just Spider-Verse at the very le- at the very least Spider Verse. See, Spider Verse was pretty fucking good, even though I haven't watched it. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like saying it like I fucking watched the movie. I haven't fucking watched the latest movie, but I've seen clips of it. It's it looks pretty fucking good. But uh, yeah, like that was literally like the only only good movie this year was Spider Verse. Oppenheimer. No, oh. I, I've seen, uh, I never seen the trailer for Oppenheimer, but I uh, forgot who was playing in it. I, I might actually give that one a go. I actually may give that a go. But, uh, yep, that's, yeah, that's, that's my end of my, uh, my movie rant. On to the next. Let's see if I can think something else. Uh, what goes on the mind of Jerry? Um, Um. No, I think I think I'm I think I'm done here. What it was like twelve minutes. But yeah, um, yeah, this is this is uh this has been ep- this has been episode two of uh Jerry talks. Fuck yeah. Tune in next time, and we might have more topics, and news, or whatever going on in Jerry's life, my life. But uh, until then, love you guys. Peace out.